Hey, how's it going everybody? So today I'm going to be doing an upgrade, um, a hardware upgrade I should say, on this computer. Now if you've seen um, my other videos uh, regarding this, uh, this is actually my mom's PC. Now I actually use this as a gaming PC whenever I come over here and actually visit. So what I'm going to be upgrading is I'm going to be upgrading the storage device. So right now I do have, I believe it's a mechanical 3.5 millimeter hard drive on this, but of course I need something a little bit better. So I'm going to be rating uh, these two uh, SSDs. So these are the PNY 500 gig SSDs. So I'm going to go ahead and rate these two to make, I guess it would be probably like a thousand gigs possibly. So yeah, let me go right ahead and do that. I have all the equipment that I need. Uh, so yeah, let's go right ahead and get to it. So as you can see right here, um, we do have the one terabyte hard drive right here. Of course, uh, I'm going to go right ahead and take that out. And then the two SSDs are going to be right here. So I'm going to go right ahead and mount them here. Um, uh, I still need to figure out exactly how these are supposed to be facing. But yeah, I'll go right ahead and uh, figure that out in a little bit. I got into a little issue, but I think we can technically go around this. So I thought this was going to be long enough to plug into the other SSD. That is not the case. So I think I can technically get away with connecting this one like this and then getting one of these connectors to connect this way. So yeah, let's go ahead and do that. All right. Okay. All right. So it looks like I figured it out. So I do have some extra fans over here in the side. And of course I need another SATA connector. So this cable only had two SATA um, connectors on them. I could technically still go get another uh, cable that has SATA on it and install it on the power supply since this is somewhat a semi-modular one. But luckily I did not have to do that and add more clutter to this. All right, cool deal. So now that we have everything, let's go right ahead and boot this up. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go right ahead and bring up disk management. So let's go right ahead and bring that up right now. All right, so there we go. So now we have disk management open. As you can see now, the computer actually figures out, hey, there's uh, two disks, uh, disk uh, zero and disk one that need to be go right ahead and basically set up. So let's go right ahead and do that right now. Okay, so on disk zero, let's go right ahead and right click on this and we're gonna do a striped volume. We're gonna hit, of course, that, hit next. And we're going to also include disk one for this. So we're going to go right ahead and add it. There we go. So now it should say total volume size in megabytes. Uh, of course, that would be around, I believe, yeah, it's less than a terabyte. So let's go right ahead and hit on next. Drive letter, yeah, let's go right ahead and leave it at D. Uh, let's go right ahead and change this and let's do data. Perform a quick format. Next, and let's run and finish. Okay, oh, that's right. So uh, I completely forgot. So we need to go ahead and change these from uh, basically being a basic disk to a dynamic disk. So luckily, Windows will automatically go ahead and do that. So let's go ahead and hit on yes regarding this. So now they're dynamic and we're squared away. So let's go ahead and view and see if everything is working correctly. So if we go into this PC, Bam, there we go. So now we actually see the two drives become one. And now uh, this is gonna technically in improve the read and write speed of this machine. So there we go. So that, technically I could go ahead and start creating files and start doing whatever I need to do in here. Alrighty, everybody. Well, I really do hope you enjoyed this video. Hopefully this was educational and you know, uh, gets you going on, you know, maybe trying to set up a, a raid on your system. But, you know, nonetheless, thank you very much for watching. And like always, we will catch you on the next one. Bring up, uh, let's see, what is it? Device, is it? Oh, okay. Well, good for you.